Hi, and welcome to episode 11 of The Sleeper. I'm Icon, and today Carlson and Chalaki will try to leave our colony. Stumpy will, well, remain with our colony. And let's just hope we will survive through whatever is headed towards us. Well, at the end of the episode, we had a self-tamed dromedary. I have no interest in that. And we receive a visit from a war merchant. So let's check that out. The war merchant here is Garatobo. Okay. There we go. Hi, Garatobo. What's up, man? You're selling or you're buying my steel knife. It's always a pleasure to see people buying my steel knives. So beyond that, I have two excellent revolvers now. <laughs> I had no clue. So we can sell away some other items here. But beyond that, well, they're selling a warg. A warg. I want. Damn. <laughs> Can't afford though. Dang. Oh no. Well, I could afford the warg if I sell my gold. So I will do. Oh, I wish I could buy both of them. Hmm. Well, that's too much, but at least we have a new warg in town. That's also a good thing. We've detected a logging work site. Oh, okay. But sadly, that's way further away than it looks like, so... Chalaki, food binging. Because of drug usage. Uh, there's no day here without somebody going nuts because he was smoking a reefer. Not a single day without smoke, uh, without a reefer sadness. Can't change it. Whatever, it's not that much of an issue. Okay, let's uh, start processing that grant because I finally want to finish my rooms here. This is going to be a bigger project, and I'm afraid that my refugees won't be staying that long for this anymore. I have decided to let them go, because I don't feel like I'm like I'm able to to pin down people like Carlson and uh, Chulaki just like that, or, well, just uh, in general, with just one uh, person able to fight, and the other person not even being a capable of tending for the prisoners. Smoke leaf addiction on Stumpy. <laughs> well, she has seen the truth. Oh no, not the smoke. So with this uh, food poisoning hanging around, we are already doomed. There will be a lot of, uh, there will be a lot of food poisonings now. Okay, the refugees are leaving. Carlson says they won't forget what we've done. Trado's cache of supplies. Well, good riddance. Okay, now we're on our own again. Trail offer retracted. Yeah, really. <laughs> Well, we got a lot of things done during their uh, presence, so I'm really okay with that. Quest completed. Yeah, I know. It's okay for me. Not too happy with uh, the situation in general, but also not absolutely unhappy with it. So I could build a new, a new solar generator if I needed it at all. The Ash Killers are attacking us. Three people. Friggin' three people against uh, us here. Though, Stumpy, are you actually able to fight? It seems the answer is yes, so... That's good. So these guys are attacking us immediately, so we, we have no time to lose. Stumpy slow or anything like that? Just stoned, I see. Okay. So the warg 
this. So. Let's see what these guys are up to. Destroying some of our uh, buildings here. Okay. So let's see what we can do here. Alright. The warg has a few issues deciding whether or whether to attack or not. This gravlock person is standing behind a rock there. This is really unfortunate. So, well... No, we're just going to do this like that. We're just going to leave his line of sight here. Alright, they're, uh, they're hunting the warg now. The pacifistic warg. Now he's not pacifistic anymore. Okay. They're fleeing already. <laughs> okay, nice. So that went a lot better than I thought. Alright, let's see if we can uh, take uh, down that crablock person, but it doesn't seem like we do. Okay, whatever. Maybe he's going down. Just gonna watch him. Hearing loss. Okay. And there's a iguana going mad. Well, one should not take that iguana like lightly. Okay, we we just have to accept that uh, the fields here are are gone. Can't change that. So, where's the iguana, though? Oh, down there, I see. So, I just hope that the fire won't be spreading to my... to my stuff here. So, yeah, we... We did lose a harvest here, an entire harvest, but I'm actually waiting until the fires have burned out. Because I don't want my people to waste their time in quenching these fires. That's the reason why I like to have large stockpiles of food available at all times. So where's my war guide? Could you please tend to your animal man? Uh, woman? Whatever. It's not like you say it. <laughs> you know what I mean. Uh, okay. So. Well. It's a little bit of a pain to have lost all that food down there. But at the end of the day, it is not that horrible. Because the this field here, on its own, should be enough to... To keep my people sated. At least the three of them. It's really good news that Stumpy was able to, to fight for us, at least. That was a big, big help. I mean... Even if you're a really uh, useless shot in general... Wield an excellent uh, quality weapon or better, and you are good for something. I like it. I like this. I mean, check out those accuracies, like 90 and 96 percent. And, uh, well, I only have a good quality one. Uh, well, can't really show off here the difference between a normal quality and an excellent quality, but you have to take my word that it's a, it's a huge qu uh, difference between these two things. Okay. So Gracie is slowly learning to cook. Actually, she's not uh, doing too bad here. And, well... Ooh, yeah, the Pookies are in town. Oh yeah, go on a binge when you hate it to, uh, to smoke smoke leaf. Alright, so... We have now... Food poisoning on Stumpy. But not on Gracie. Okay, this is going to be a very, very, uh, very, very dangerous situation there. Oh, 
Lydell, Body Modder. Okay. The real good news there, I have traps to hide behind. And I can't take the initiative on these guys. This corner here is really, really turning me off. Oh well, whatever. We're we're not going to do this. Uh, and Gracie now has the pukies too. Stumpy needs some rescue. Oh god. We've been raided a moment ago. Why is this happening? Fire? Ah, they they come for, from the uh, other direction again. Okay, that Cuevas person though. Give it rat. That's good. And Gracie can use her uh, her pain block. Pain block is really good to uh, to get rid of the the side effects of the food poisoning. So anarchist. If this anarchist person goes down, we might have already won. Yeah, we did. That's why I wanted that warp, you know. Look at this monster. <laughs> okay, so sir. The Forester. No capabilities of medical and social. Okay, whatever. I mean, the other skills are all good. And we are not in the position that I want to be too picky. You know? So we're going to imprison that uh, Sir person here. There we go. <laughs> these fields are quite doomed <laughs> so let's uh let's tend that person and let's see all right i want to convert i mean gracie's uh actually able to to pull this off Pretty good at that as well. Oh man, they all got the wriggles. Oh come on, Stumpy. At least rescue people. Okay, so I'm pretty sure that we will now survive whatever happens next. Because we have already survived the worst case scenario of having to fight a, a fully fledged raid while everybody is on food poisoning. That's among the most dangerous things in RimWorld, but since we have also survived that, I am actually pretty, pretty positive. So, let's see. <laughs> Victoria. Oh, guys. So, what about that Sir person? Hmm. How about feeding? <laughs> there we go. And Stumpy got the wriggles too. Oh man. <laughs> this is such a catastrophic run. I'm actually more than surprised that I I'm not dead yet. I mean, <laughs> Gracie refreshed her, uh, her food. <laughs> This all might be not real, but it's a real nightmare for sure. <laughs> Dear. This is really, really bad. <laughs> Gracie, you need to stop poisoning everybody here. And <laughs> we need to feed those poor people. Why is nobody feeding them? All right, Gracie, you're you're also supposed to convert. Wow, two percent. <laughs> and down she goes. All right, consuming raw potatoes now because we're all out of uh, cooked food. Alright, Gracie, one more go. Please don't produce uh, 
spoiled meals again. Donkeys joined. Oh, come on. What the heck am I supposed to do with donkeys at this point? Well, at least, uh, at least... Oh, wait a sec. Dang. At least when the, the Stumpy quest is over, we're, we're going to be plus one, you know? Oh yeah, sir. Let me guess, starving again. You need to convert. And you need to do it regularly. Like, for real, crazy. Okay. So we're going to micromanage that now. Because I really need to convert that person as, as soon as possible. It's so important for us. So let's see how many... Uh, Care about the uh, donkey running away. Food binge, Victoria. I'm going to micromanage the conversion of uh, Sir and check it out if I can convert several times at, per day or if it's only a thing once per day or however it might work. Transport pod crash. Monero. Not affiliated to any faction. The Stoned Party. Incapable of dumb labor and cleaning. But beyond that, a really, really, really crafty person. So we're going to rescue Manero. I don't have the res resources to force that guy. The work is uh, starving. Come on, dude. There's food. You just need to eat. Malnutrition severe. Jeez. That's really, really not necessary. So if Monero wants to join us, he shall do so. So let's see if this Monero guy wants to join us. I'm really, really uh, curious about that, but... I don't want to have a second prison cell. I mean, we all see how good this already works. So, the whole situation here is a mess. Overall, we are massively understaffed, and all these food poisonings in between were just the icing on the cake to, to make everything go wonky, but that's okay. That's okay, so... We're slowly uh, getting that guy down. All right, cook some more because we need to, and I need to micromanage transport of the potatoes. Okay, Monero wants to leave us. What a shame. But with unreal people, I, I don't care. Okay, so that was a second conversion in a pretty short amount of time. So I think I can do the uh, the conversion several several times per day. Should be not a problem at all. So I wish there would be a convert and reduce resistance at the same time. That would be really cool. Pods arrived. Okay, so I think it's Carlson a Massive amount of useless things. Yeah, not really. Master Warp Revolver. That's massive. But at the same time, it's not really not really that useful. Oh yeah, Gracie produced another uh, batch of Nightmare Meals. So. This is just not cool. Yeah. Now that process begins all over again. So. Yeah, the donkey is roaming away. Couldn't care less. <laughs> oh, 
Oh boy, this is so brutal. I can't, I can't remember when I had such massive problems the last time. Like, this is really, really outrageous. Monero went berserk. Okay. Yo, dude, weren't you supposed to just, uh... To just leave? What happened, dude? Okay. So, yeah, it's the... It's the pukey madness all over again, and, uh... She's going to refresh her food poisoning again, isn't she? So, malnutrition, yes, but at least she's now all really. I can't rescue Monero. That's the most ironic thing. He's bleeding to death now. Because I forgot to patch him up when Gracie was mobile again. But honestly, it was more important for me to, to feed Gracie over... Uh, Patching up that guy. And uh, here we go. It also looks like uh, Gracie's meals were... were food poisoned uh, twice. Like, she's rolling, like, so massively bad. It's amazing. It's really, uh, really impressive. See? Nope. Actually, it was only one batch. Okay. So, I mean, it's only a chance of, let's see, 2%. 2 percent. 2 friggin' percent. <laughs> Dave's Lost Refugees. Catatonic. Are you kidding me? Catatonic. Seriously. Friggin' hell. <laughs> <laughs> hey, come on in, Dave. He claimed to have escaped an organ harvesting operation. Okay, man. Whatever, dude. Whatever. You are most welcome here. We need help. <laughs> Send help. We need. Oh, boy. This is horrible. So, anybody here is a decent cook? Awesome. Okay. So let's just hope that these guys are no traitors, because otherwise we're just doomed. <laughs> otherwise we're just doomed. And that's Sir Guy. Can, can somebody please uh, take care? Moderate malnutrition? Moderate friggin' malnutrition? <laughs> What is happening here? Where am I? In hell? Okay. So let's see. Yeah, there's more food poisoning. Oh my god. Why? <laughs> okay, so let's see. Dave will will depart in six days. And Stumpy will deport, depart in two days. That's good. That's just what I need. Alright. Yeah, we get more food poisonings. Mm, friggin' bloody bad cooks. <laughs> What's that? This two person chance is bugged. <laughs> wow. Holy moly. So uh, this is just silly. It's fun too, but it's uh it's also very, very silly. Can't remember that I ever had something like that. I mean sure, cooking three ain't much. I, I perfectly admit that. But everything beyond that, are you guys freaking serious with me? Days, Dave, because he took drugs. What's up with those religions here? They're all like teetotalers. 
the like third person who goes crazy because of this uh, drug usage here in my colony. It's like the reaper of sadness is all upon us. What is this? What, what is this uh, tragic planet? Everybody hates taking drugs. Jeez. All right, Amanda, you can do it. Oh boy. Oof. That's pretty. That's, that's pretty bleak. Not gonna lie. Okay. So if these guys are trying to take over this uh, place. I'm. I'm totally doomed. I'm just doomed then. Meanwhile, I bet this uh, guy is not going to be converted in any way. Or, well, probably he does. I mean, I have signed the wardening priority really, really high. Who knows? So, let's say... Mm -hmm. Bio. Where's the log? Ah, here. Isn't there a detail? Ah, here. So, she's a catatonic since 2.5 days now. Okay, there's kind of a chance that she might get back up, but more, more, like, it's, uh, more likely that she's not going to. Okay. Just realized that broken wind turbine. I don't like that. Rumbos! Awesome! They'll eat my crops! Bloody animals. Seriously, not cool. So, there's uh, yet again another betrayal offer. A mad dromedary is in town. Why is it injured? Oh, because of the trap. Okay, so Dave and Amanda, you guys are going to rescue the colony now from the mad dromedary. Hope at least. So, well, is my work actually at this point already trained? No, he ain't. Mm. Okay, well, we're just going to take the detour and, uh, okay, now pick up some guns. And shoot down that filthy dromedary. Ratatata. Good job, Dave. Alrighty. So, Amanda. No, 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 no. You guys, you don't like to take drugs. I know it. It's always the same with you. Then you're uh, pissed with me again. Alright. Maybe not. I don't know. So, all right, shuttle arrived. Ooh, it's Stumpy's shuttle finally there. Oh my god. See you later, Stumpy. Oh, I can't uh, put Stumpy there. The quiet capybaras. Okay, whatever. Come on, Stumpy, snap out already. Stumpy is also heat stroking. Gosh. Binge on Victoria and Shaman Merchant. I mean, worst case scenario, Stumpy will break down and I'll carry her in there. But, you know, there are more elegant ways of doing this. Alright. So, Stumpy, get into that shuttle. Stumpy just took another joint before, before uh, setting off. Okay, hi Berg. Really, really happy to see you here. Okay. Psychic shock lance equipped immediately. I like this. I like how this woman thinks. Okay. So, we need to do jobs here. The most important thing is that Burke is a social person and a good doctor. Two things we haven't had yet in the colony. 
so really important things. Okay, let's do this like that. Okay, so handling. Is anybody here good at handling? Human celebration expected. I know, but what could I do? I mean, there's nothing here to do for you. Okay, so we need a couple of dusters, I see, and a couple of cowboy hats. Anybody here on high tailoring duty? No? Gosh. This place, this place is a mess. Oh, these guys have a social fight, I see. Okay. Gracie, welcome back among us. That's awesome. Drifters wish for aid. 17 smoke leaf. Well, I'm not really uh, a fan, gotta admit. Okay, but it seems like the worst has, uh, the worst fallout has settled. So, Berg, you are going to equip that Masterwork Revolver. Didn't I receive a Masterwork Revolver? Yeah. Okay, and that person needs to be converted. There we go. Finally, we're back on track. Okay, so yeah, that's uh, that's food poisoning. That's how bad it can get. Jeez. Alrighty, thanks for watching, everybody. We will continue this wonderful series in the next episode. Let's just build another air conditioner while we're at it. And I'd be really happy if you guys would smack some comments down below. And as usual, leave a thumbs up on that video if you enjoyed the show. And we're going to do a human celebration in the next episode, and as always, feel free to subscribe to my channel, daily content there, I'd be super happy if you turned on the notifications too. Cheers, and see you guys next time. Bye-bye!